Hey, what's up, YouTube? Okay, so in the last couple days, there's been a, a lot of hubbub about the radiation in Japan, of course. And uh, I don't mean to downplay it in any way. Of course, it's a serious crisis, and Japan is, is really, really screwed, and it's just a, you know, devastating event. But uh, I wanted to share with you guys uh, a couple links that I have here. And the first link is to an article from actually from the 21st. And uh, the title is Little Risk from Japanese Food Exports Here. And basically what this article goes on to talk about is the, the uh, actual logistics of Japan not being a very large exporter of food. And in fact, let me read a couple things here. It says, actually, according to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, Japan is the world's largest net importer of food and ag agricultural products. Um, it also says, Japanese food exports to the United States accounts for just 0.12% of the total volume of all food and agricultural imports into the U.S. So, Japan, 0.12% of our food comes from Japan. Uh, I mean, that's, you know, that's a minuscule amount. The other thing is, I'm going to give you guys, I'm going to try and post this direct link to, what's the name of the site here? Um, sorry, I lost it. The Japanese External Trade Organization, and they have a, a great PDF where it basically gives you all the data it's about nine pages long and it gives you all the data of Japanese uh, agricultural exports and it's got a bunch of graphs and charts and it actually tells you like exactly how many tons of powdered milk for example uh, 2000, 2000, 2008 2009 they exported 3,000 tons of powdered milk so now you know and, and you can sleep well tonight but no it's a totally cool thorough PDF and if you have any interest in glancing through it it's there for you to take a look at but the bottom line is that uh, Japan does not export a lot of food so in that aspect we're, we really shouldn't uh, you know see too much of an effect of that throughout the rest of the world that's basically about it and unfortunately Japan does uh, export a lot of cool snack food and well I mean everybody knows what they export but I guess no more Pocky that's depressing at least for a while alright later YouTube